Hey kids, today we're going to learn about the prison system in Ontario. The prison system in place has proven to have its problems. The people we paint as problematic have gotten the short end of the socioeconomic stick. The system is rigged against them. Developers in the province are making a fortune. Incarceration blowing way up out of proportion. The fuller the jail, the more they get to build. Bail and remand is inherently flawed. With seven out of ten detainees waiting for court. And every politician telling you it's a must is all but secretly betraying and exploiting your trust. That is what the dog does. That is what the dog does. Throw them in the cell and watch the money pile up. That's what he does. Hey, look who stopped by to say hello. It's Stanley. Hey. Pretty sad situation about all the jails in Ontario, isn't it, Stanley? Pretty sucky. And Doug Ford now wants to build a new one in the small, peaceful town of Kempville. Well, don't get me started on that. Paving over perfectly good farmland for something we don't even need. Who does he think he is? Right now, it seems like he's someone who just doesn't care. Now, I'm trying to explain to people how bad prisoners have it and how most of them should not even be in a jail cell. Yeah, people with mental health and addiction issues need help, not to be thrown in a cage. Absolutely. And that's just a few examples. Stanley, do you think anyone considers who actually pays for all this? Oh, well, you can leave that up to me. The simple narrative told about the prison in question Has given the old and young a faulty impression Don't you know the funding comes from you and your family Your taxes are gonna be paying for all this shit They say the jobs will emerge and we're all gonna profit The truth is every last position's already locked in Their salaries are yours to pay for Did I mention the provincial police? The cost of every service call will fall at your feet The millions and the millions on the housing alone Say did you really reckon this expense would not be your own? That is what the dog does That's right! That is what the dog does Throwing all of us directly under the bus That's what he does Stanley, can you believe Doug Ford just won a majority government? Wait a minute, you're telling me the majority voted for that guy? Oh, hell no. Only 18% of eligible voters did. What? There's no way he's in charge then. Well, he is. Thanks to an unfair and seriously outdated voting system in Ontario called First Past the Post. A big problem is people don't bother to go vote, so we don't even know what they're thinking. Or if they're thinking at all. Exactly. I'm sad. Well, aren't we all, Stanley? Aren't we all? That is what the dog does. That is what the dog does. Leading thanks to people too lazy to vote. That's what he does.